episode 2. Today we are going to talk about the first African American US representative, Joseph Hain Rainey. He was born in 1832 and died in 1887. In 1870, Republican Joseph Hain Rainey became the first African American to be elected to the United States House of Representatives and take his seat. Others were elected earlier but were not seated. Rainey was born in Georgetown, South Carolina on June 21st, 1842. His parents had been slaves but his father purchased his family's freedom and taught him to be a barber. The family moved to Charlestown in 1846. Rainey, however, traveled frequently outside the South and married in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in 1859. In 1861, Joseph Rainey was drafted to work on a Confederate blockade runner during the Civil War. In 1862, he escaped it to Bermuda with his wife and worked there as a barber before returning to South Carolina in 1866. Once back in the state, he joined the executive committee of the newly formed South Carolina Republican Party. In 1868, he was elected a delegate to the State Constitutional Convention. Two years later, in 1870, Rainey was elected to a four-year term in the State Senate, where he soon became the chairman of the Finance Committee. His tenure in the South Carolina State Senate was brief. When South Carolina Congressman Benjamin F. Whitmore registered Rainey won the seat in a special election. He served in the 41st Congress and was appointed to the Committee on Freedmen's Affairs and the Committee on the Indian Affairs. Rainey ran for re-election in 1872 without opposition. In May 1874, he became the first African American representative to preside over a House section. In 1876, with the Democrats were emerging as the dominant force in South Carolina at the end of Reconstruction, reigning barely defeat Democrat John S. Richardson for Congress. And Joseph Hain Rainey died in Georgetown on August 2, 1887, leaving a widow and five children. He was 55 at the time of his death.